Well, this morning, firefighters working to contain a large wildfire burning near Estacada. The 36 pit fire first sparked Saturday near Highway 224. Now, Brent Weisberg has been live all morning near the fire lines. He has the very latest out there. Brent? Jenny, good morning to you. We are about eight miles away from that fire line. I want to show you what is happening this morning. Take a look. You can see the sunrise starting to come up. You can also see how orange the sky is right now because of all the smoke that's in the air. We can give you another perspective too. Take a look at our light right now. You can see some of the ash that is coming through right now. We are at the American Red Cross shelter here in Estacada. That is where about eight people are getting help, including some of their pets here. You can see some of the individuals this morning loading up right now, trying to get answers from firefighters. This morning, we do know firefighters have been working to try to contain this fire overnight. Right now, they are worried about the uh, Silver Fox RV park. That is still being threatened because of this fire. Its size, according to incident commanders, is about 1,000 acres. We do know that firefighters right now are getting breakfast. Just got an update from one of the firefighters on scene. They say they will have another update pretty soon, but at this point they cannot say the size. They still say it's about a thousand acres. Investigators believe that people target shooting are responsible. The fire is burning in the Mount Hood National Forest overnight. Several homes at the end of the Hillock Burn, er, excuse me, Hillock Burn Road area were told they may need to evacuate, and that is right now the biggest area of concern. We and many others have no insurance on those RVs. What we have is there. There are about 100 firefighters working to get the upper hand on this fire. At this point, it is not contained. It continues to burn in grass and timber. More resources today heading this way. Right now, firefighters say they are still concerned, though, with the forecast, which continues to call for hot and dry conditions. Back here at the American Red Cross Shelter in Estacada, you can see these individuals. We just talked to them. They say they, too, are waiting on an update from firefighters. And again, we have been told that that next update expected around 8 o'clock this morning. As soon as we get it, we will update you right here on Coin6 and on Coin.com. Jenny, back to you. Very hazy out there. Okay, thank you, Brent. And the